Berlin Berlin Massage and Skin in Burlington, Vermont. And today I wanted to show you uh, a peel demonstration with PCA Skin. Now this video is not sponsored by PCA. I'm just sharing to uh, make people not be afraid of peels because it can sound intimidating and people heard different stories. Oh, my face is gonna peel off, it's gonna be hurt, it's gonna be hurting. That is not true unless you get a really deep peel, which is which those are usually done at dermatologists' offices. Only here we are estheticians and we are PCA certified estheticians. So I'm gonna demonstrate um, Sensi Peel in particular today, which is um, a peel that is safe even for people with rosacea, people with sensitive skin, St. Patrick's uh, scale. One people kind of like Nicholas here today, my trusty demo person. What's better than um, to have a handy husband who can help out with uh, peel demos? Okay, so um, usually we start, well, any facial or peel, which we're also gonna start today with our facial wash, oily problem skin. Uh, that is uh, PCA's protocol. So we're going to cleanse the skin and I'm not going to do a peel on the beard, obviously. Uh, I couldn't convince him to shave today, but we are going to do the cheeks to nose, the forehead, because men age too. Everyone ages and peels are really great for um, getting the glow back, exfoliating the skin, eradicating those fine lines and wrinkles, and if there's any texture issues, you know, if someone had acne before, acne scarring, different kinds of peels. There are peels that address hyperpigmentation uh, and pore size and people who have, um, you know, currently have acne, which is not really the case for Nicholas. He is more of a dry skin guy. So he's lucky that he doesn't get uh, clogged pores as much, but he does get some sun damage and that's why peel can help to also eliminate, peels can help to eliminate those um, early sunspots from occurring and of course wearing sunscreen. So next I'm going to apply smoothing toner, which is going to help us gauge the sensitivity of the skin. Um, so Nicholas, one to 10, what would you say the sensation or activity you're experiencing on your face? Zero. Zero, okay, so that is great news. We are, actually would even be able to do uh, more intense peel on him. This doesn't sound like he's sensitive, actually. Uh, he does burn quickly, though, so that's why I thought maybe we'll start with Sensi Peel first. And it's always a good idea to start with something that would be tolerable to that kind of skin. So now we gauge sensitivity. Now we're going to take a cotton swabs and we're going to apply three to four dabs of the Sensi Peel, the cotton swab, and we're going to apply one layer of the peel. And in a minute, we're going to ask Nicholas, how is he feeling about this sensation. How are you feeling so far? It's like a five. Like a five, okay. So we're going to fan him to reduce that tingling a little bit. And then we'll see how he feels. 
and we might apply a second layer. Usually we go here as well, we do avoid the eye area and the neck we only just do small dabs like this. But he has hair over there so we're gonna not mess with that area. Now how is the tingling when I'm fanning? It's a little less, right? Correct. Okay, so we're gonna give it a little bit of time and because he was a five we actually might not add another layer. And these are, peels are not ever washed off. We never want to mix them with water because these are self-neutralizing peels. They neutralize in a couple of minutes once they get on the skin. If we added water, his pH would drop and it would start burning and tingling. Um, so no steam towels, no washing your face. For up to you know, four hours, I wouldn't go to saunas or pools but just let ingredients do their job with any PCA products or any facial that you're getting. How's the sensation, how's the activity right now? Better. 1 to 10? 2. A 2. So we're just gonna uh, not do another layer just for the video purposes. What we uh, learned about how easy and quick it is to do a peel. So now we're going to add some serums and these serums can be customized. For Nicholas, I am going to add x Peptide Serum. For certain spots, it's a nice anti-aging serum, which does have activities, so it, you might feel some sensation right now which is normal, but it's usually not very intense. And we are also gonna add anti-redness serum for Nicholas. Are you feeling any sensations right now? No. Okay, so his skin uh, is doing well. And then we are going to apply uh, Revalance moisturizer for the skin and then we're gonna finish with sunscreen. HPCA has different kinds of sunscreens, you know, perfecting, hydrating. I think I will put the perfecting sunscreen on him just because he does have some uh, sun damage already here. We also could do a peel for hyperpigmentation on him next time and then apply hydroquinone serum for for the um the discoloration as well but um so uh, usually if peeling does occur it does occur about a day two and it's usually, it really will depend on each individual skin how much exfoliation actually occurs. And sometimes you can even see that stratum corneum like coming off. It might look like a dry skin, but no, it's just those dead skin cells coming off. And nice new layer is, will be showing the glowing layer that was underneath. Underneath, and sometimes you don't see feeling at all um, and but all, all you see is nice smoother more glowing skin better pores and um, and uh, you know it's good to also do good aftercare too that will determine how your skin feels too so make sure you use aftercare package you know moisturizer and sunscreen, definitely avoiding sunscreen. That's why winter, t sorry, avoiding sun, not sunscreen. That's why winter is the best time to get peels because your exposure will be the least to the sun, but doesn't mean you shouldn't wear sunscreen. You should, even we apply sunscreen, even if we do a peel or a facial in the evenings. 
Well, if you would like to uh, try a chemical peel with PCA Pro Certified Professional, get in touch. Your brilliant massage and skincare here in Burlington, Vermont. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe, like. If you have any questions, any ideas, any experience you want to share you have with peels, please leave them in the comments below. We're also going to launch memberships here very soon at Brilliant Massage and Skin. And I hope to see you soon for massage or facial. We also offer massages here. But um, would love to uh, chat. Like I said, any questions or uh, experience, I'd love to hear. Bye. <laughs>